Right then, guys. It's that time again. Right then, let's start it off. Welcome back to DJB Channel Brown, guys. Right then. Um, like I was saying yesterday about I haven't been myself lately. Um, I've come back to being myself again. So all I can do is thank people for what they've done for me. So uh, Ant first, Carrie, uh, another one, Stephen Airdrop, uh, my family as well, and all the other people. I'm, I'm starting to feel a lot, lot better than I did. Uh, I've been really, really down. Um, I thought I had depression, but I'm getting, I'm getting better now. I'm getting a lot, lot better. Um, and there's going to be a bigger, bigger video tomorrow, guys. Carries up mine tomorrow, so there's going to be a bigger video. Um, and all I want, all I wanted to talk about was me really today, because. I know there's a lot of people on here who know me. There's a lot of people who know me. And um I just wanna do a little bit about uh bit a little bit about me and um Carrie can do her own video about herself but I wanna say uh, a few little bits about me. Um I grew up in I grew up in West Brom when I was a baby and then I moved to Sutton Coalfield. And then I went to school over there as well, sort of Coalfield. And then when I left senior school, I went to the College of Food for two years. And then I left there and I went to Balfour with all a load of lads, a load of girls who I know. And if you do watch these guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. I am not chefing at the moment. I'm trying to get back into it, guys, but. Nothing out there at the moment because Corona's going round. But all to my Balfour mates who I used to know. Nice to see you and thank you. Uh, I know I keep in contact with Stephen Eardrop a lot. He's like a brother to me. I mean, you do to watch you, Steve. You are like a brother to me, mate. And thank you for all your support. Thank you. Um, you are a good dad, by the way. You are a good dad, Steve. You are. Um, well, I mean, you have had our disagreements over the years, mate, but still, still, still close to me, mate. Still, still close. Um, a lot of chefs at the Balfour I used to have a lot of time for when I used to work there, guys. A lot, a lot of people, but I can't, I can't, I'm not going to mention people or not. I know I mentioned Steve because I mentioned Steve in quite a few of my videos, but. I won't mention anybody else on like, on here, but you know who you are, and all I can say is when I used to work with you, thank you, you've been good. There's one guy who's had me today. I'm not going to I'm not going to mention him on here, but it's nice to have a conversation with you today. And if you ever are in Litchfield, let me know. I'll come meet you. I'll come for a chat. Or if anybody who I know who knows me and I've worked with you, send me a text on Instagram and I'll meet up with you. It'll be nice. Um, another thing is, like I say, keep washing your hands, keep yourself clean and all that lot. And I'll be back tomorrow with another video. So, thank you for watching. I know it's not very long today because um, I'm out at this particular moment but thank you to everybody and I want to thank Steve as well and he's on the corner by me if you'd see him out say hello to him he's a guy who sits in a wheelchair Auntie would tell you because Auntie's seen him not yesterday the day before he sits in a wheelchair he's got a villa he's got a villa coat on if you see him out guys talk to him and he's had a lot of He's had a lot of health problems, guys, and he's a good friend of mine, so if you do see him, talk to him. He's a legend, man. He's a legend. So, thank you for watching, and please come back tomorrow. See you later, guys, and thank you for watching. Bye-bye.
Boom.